really exciting to see 40 producers together in Seoul. And this will be the first experience for all of us to get together. And uh, I'm looking forward to know everyone. I'm very happy to be here to uh, exchange with uh, all the producers from the Asian region. And I'm expecting to have more discussion and sharing on this topic. I'm coming here to as an observer and, and try to meet more people and hopefully um, similar network we can develop in a Chinese-speaking region and then eventually network with the Asian producer network. Wonderful. And similarly, I'm here really looking at the Southeast Asian region and how it can perhaps look closer to the East Asian models for development and mobility. Yeah. And making friends. Yes, exactly. <laughs> APP Camp is an agent network for producers' professional development. By considering environment change in performing art fields, uh, we questioned about what is our new role. Actually, how much we, we know Asia, what is Asian contemporary. Uh, based on that, we discuss a lot about how we uh, collaborate more, especially focus on creative thinking and also conceptual idea of finding local context in Asia. とか、it's been fascinating listening to all the producers talking about their collaborative work and knowing that there's a really strong will amongst them to collaborate um, amongst all of us here at the platform within Asia. A very interesting thing I've found though is that a lot of the companies and producers who are already doing collaborations are more likely to be collaborating with their artists and artists from Europe rather than with other artists from Asia. So I think that um, this platform will be a really interesting way for us all to find ways in which to start communicating and finding through our different artistic practices ways in which we can work together. producers to collaborate because as our world changes through technology and travel and we spend more time in each other's places we need to understand each other just as people and art is the opportunity to facilitate those discussions and to learn about each other's traditions and cultures and to create new stories together. It's very painful to work with him because it's very hard to understand what he talk about in his direction. But she plays a lot with duration and endurance and kind of brings the world into, the, into these. That's the out. In case you have a look to focus on in order to develop our identity as Asians, which is something that we can really only do in collaboration, in conversation with each other. It's not something that can be achieved by ourselves. It really is something that has to be done between Asian countries, between Asian arts communities, between Asian producers themselves. It's not me who 
who say that is him. Uh, who say that? Is him? <laughs> to go and we divided ourselves up into groups and had to go and do a research project. So we went on a little bit of a, a field trip and visited a couple of spaces within Seoul. There was a huge difference between government run spaces and artist run spaces and the kind of energy and environment that they were creating. What we've realised is that there's actually a place in the artistic ecology for kind of both of those environments um, to coexist. It was interesting to have all these perspectives come in, inform us about how many platforms, some maybe a bit more structured, some a bit more informal, but all in helping next generation artists. So uh, it'll be interesting to see how uh, these lessons learned apply back to our own uh, uh, examples back home. This is uh, a, a event that really um, designed to take actions and to dig deep into our cultural roots and also to build up a very close relationship um, among all the members and I think these are all the key elements to any future um, potential collaboration here. So I found that like first we have to feel interest on each other's uh, words. I mean the producing work and uh, through the um, this time through the conversation we um, actually we found a lot of uh, interesting topics and common topics and common interests so we can uh, go deep on that and to develop it I think now I feel that uh, uh, being a producer should be more creative than the artist so it's about us passing uh, opening up the way for conversations to happen in the next generation of producers and I think that has been one of the biggest successes for me of the camp is that there's a reality to it. There's, there's, we're talking about real issues. It's not a government organisation. It's, it's producers talking to producers about producer issues. And so I think that was the real value for me of the, of the camp. And the organising committee was so much fun to work with. We had very clear, very shared vision about what we wanted to achieve. And I think, I think we got there. I think we made it happen. And I'm really, really happy at the end of this camp 
Despite the fact that it was a lot of work and, and a lot of talking and a lot of commitment from everyone to make it happen, to find the money in everybody's countries to, to make it happen, to come to Korea, but it's an extraordinary success and I'm very happy. Okay, now we just finished our 2014 app camp in Seoul. Um, during the last you know, seven days, we found our vision and our, our, found, you know, our common goal. So from now on, we will start again. So we will meet you know, all together next you know, 2015 in Taiwan. Uh, we do you know, more energy and more passion and more idea in Asia. So see you everybody in 2015. See you.